I'm speed running death and taxes. Is it working? Two hundred damn. I'm listening to what the globe tells me. I expect you in my office for a performance review after you're done today. Do not worry about that right now. Just focus on your tax. Six humans have to die. Anyone related to the transport industry has to die. Choose humans on the left side of the posters to fucking die. Alright, whatever. Suck my fucking dick, alright? She dies. He lives. <laughs> he lives. I'll get the economy back up in a minute. Oh, God. She's a good REA 29 truck. Long distance trucking can be really boring or frustrating or meditative. Gives plenty of time to contemplate issues and listen to the radio or audio podcast. At least that's what she she's a good uses the time for. Their aspiration is to one day not drive trucks across the land. Okay, uh... Shit. I can fix this. Yep. Okay, we're still, we're still on the good, we're still on the good. Uh, Ellie... Godfrey, age 19, uh, keyboardist. Ellie is not a... Virtuoso. They are also not exactly what people would call particularly talented. However, they work hard and practice a lot. Their band has started doing all right, and Ellie has been able to quit their service sector job to become a full time keyboardist. They have a fan. Yeah. Yeah. Awesome. All right, did I do you? Oh! Well, I already know what to do. All right, two more, and then fate can get off my ass. She lives! I didn't fuck up that one this time. Okay. Mathematics teacher, Meta Vander. Uh, okay, so what the fuck is this guy? Are you do you? Okay, uh... Melinda's doctoral thesis was about calculating the parameters around conflict and situations. Uh, afterwards, I decided to put that research to the test at a rough, at a rough enough environment school. They're into skiing and crafting little paper birds or fractals. Okay. Yeah. Though I did fuck up on, on money a little bit. That's so fine. Okay, the drug dealer. Uh. uh small time criminal, low grade narcotics. Uh, Not really. Small no one can ask you 
So he has no clue, huh? He has no fucking idea. Congratulations, Grim. You've passed the performance review. As expected, but let us not dwell on the past. I need you to focus on the future. This will be a tough day and a tentative. Six humans have to die. Three humans, at least with the scientific uh, background, have to die. At least two humans age 30 have to die. Humans are so easily corrupted. Fate. Who is he? A smuggler? Uh, tres, uh, cool. Trick collision! Oh my god! <laughs> what? Look at his last name! Oh. No, <laughs> oh, he's a fucking smuggler! There's no fucking way, dude! What? What's the joke? He's a smuggler and his last name is Collision. He smuggles guns! Oh... Oh my god! <laughs> oh, it's a dark-ass joke! Alright, uh, there isn't a thing Trey won't smuggle in or out of the country. Whatever it is, they'll find a way. Drugs, guns, endangered animals, antiques, artifacts, uh, even people. They have no scalpels or no hidden pr principles. Oh, shit. Alright, hold up. Well, I already know what to do with her. Yup. Get the fuck out of here, miss. Alright, you're dead. Uh, you. Economy's gonna go up when you die, so you get to fucking die. <laughs> Goodbye! <laughs> have a good... <laughs> Bye, have a great time. Okay, uh, let's see. Another person I gotta find you. Okay, hold up. You live! Hold up. You live. Yes, queen! You get to live. Alright, what about you? Okay, you're dead. <laughs> you're fucking dead. Money launderer, goodbye. I don't need to do with your shit. Okay. Uh, oh, motherfucker. Okay. I already know what happens if I keep him alive. I keep him dead. I know health. Oh, shit. Okay. Well, six have to fucking die. But I don't want to mess with this, so I already have. Oh, Alright, guess you gotta die. Alright, that was somewhat of a good choice. Okay. Martin, uh, Vito, Vito Kick. Uh, age, age 22, uh, conscript. All Martin wants to do in life is to be creative. But harsh reality has forced them against their will into a situation they have no control over until they return from military service centers. Oh, shit. <laughs> I wish there was... Was that the smart move? Please show me a sign. Okay, that was a good move. I was scared for a minute. Oh, God. Andres Con... Uh, Contreras, age 30, uh, position graffiti artist slash business person. During the day, Andreas is a small time op entrepreneur, but secretly they're a naive, impressionistic painter. Their graffiti is found on many walls. Maybe anonymous, anonymously at night. Andrea suspects their art has mystical powers. Try add positive karma to nice houses, but it's unclear if they they're fully in control of these powers. Oh, uh, 
let's test that theory. Okay, well, I was able to get more peace in, so... A little sacrifice has to be made. Yes. You did it, Raven. You have a chance. Let's go! Your grand you are great. Let's fucking go! Soon, you'll be but mere moats beside your blazing blade. Bask in my splendor, O oh mirror! I love the mirror. They're probably one of my favorite characters. I didn't understand in the beginning, but I understand that they're trying to help us. And we'll see what fate wants in the next bonus video. Bye, guys.